You look at uh, the housing on the Canadian side of Niagara Falls versus the American side. Very interesting. On the Canadian side, the 3047 St. Patrick Avenue, you can get a tiny shack for $549,900. On the American side, you get a much bigger standalone home for $164,000. Wow. Five Forty-nine on the Canadian side, 164 on the American wow. side, both Niagara Files. Why the discrepancy, Housing Minister? He spouts uh, about numbers, he talks about housing affordability. Uh, when it comes to housing supply, he's voted against measures to increase housing supply. When it, when it comes to housing affordability and measures to help home buyers, he's voted against them. So we've established that the, on the American side, house prices are roughly half of what they are on the Canadian side. I've asked why multiple times. It can't be population. They have 10 times the people. It can't be landmass. They have less land than we do. The answer is that government gatekeepers block construction. He claims that he's doing something about that, but he has been in this role and his, his prime minister has been in this job for eight years. If they were going to solve the problem, they would have by now, but everything is worse.